Tell me about uh, today, Overtime Elite Pro Day. How did it go for you? I think it was great to be the first time in the main court. So when we're doing workouts and stuff, you know, I think it was great to share my team is, um, and put on a show. See the NBA Cascal all over the world, it's, you know, feels great. What was it like to be in front of 60 NBA scouts at the same time? It's great. I mean, it's great every time, like, people that you showing your talent to people from the NBA. But I think the main, the, for, for me, the main thing, I, I every time try to do the thing that I, I used to do, like, you know, play normal, be comfortable with the ball and that kind of stuff. It seemed like, uh, you know, you're known as a guy that can really score, that can put the ball in the basket. It feels like you showed a different part of your game today. You were making some great reads in the half court, you know, getting other guys involved. Is that something that you were wanting to show or is that just an underrated part of your game? Yeah, I think it, that's underrated because I, I like to share the ball with my teammates. You know, I, I like to put my teammates in the game get engaged because I need them to win and they need me to win too. So everybody needs in the team to win, to get a win. So that's why I, I shared the ball with my teammates and made sure that they happy, they playing good, you know. How, uh, you know, what was your decision-making process like in terms of com deciding to come here? You know, most of these guys are coming from high school. You were playing on a top-level team in Spain, playing Euro Cup. Um, you know, was it was it a difficult decision? Uh, the first, it was difficult, but once I understand, like, what my, goals, what my goal is, you know, I, I just made the decision quick. And once I stepped on um, DR in Dominican Republic, so... I talked with my family, my dad, mom, and I said, man, that's what I want. I want to improve my game to the next level. I think OT is going to help me out to get that, that uh, to that level. How does it compare here so far with, with Gran Canaria? Man, you know, it's a different world, European basketball and U.S. State, American basketball. It's way different. Like, in Europe, you play more, like, in static. And America, you play, like, up and down. You can play static plays, but they like to run, you know. I can play on both sides of the court. How did it help you playing and practicing two years with, you know, real pros and, and playing high-level basketball? Yeah, I mean, they helped me a lot over there because I understand the basketball and playing in time. You know, uh, I used to play with pros, 30 years old, guys, 35 years old. They helped me a lot. But what a work of basketball is, you know, how to got, how to got to work to get to the next level, you know. I yeah. think they, they help me out a lot, and I appreciate them. I feel I feel so thankful with them to help me out that part of my career. What do you think you can bring an NBA team? NBA team, I think I can bring energy, joy, and effort. Yeah, I think I get I can bring the, those three teams. You know, every time I every time I step out of the court, I, I want to do the best of me. I want to help my teammates, and that. That, that brings, like, bring the energy, effort, and that kind of stuff. I'm gonna get that stuff. <laughs> What's the biggest thing you need to work on? I think uh, I, gotta, I gotta keep improving my shoot, dribble, and my body. I think those, those are three things I gotta keep improving. Um, what is it like, you know, living out here in Atlanta? What's the experience been like with, with OTE so far? It's been great, man. You know, it's my first time being like staying here, like month and in Atlanta. But I like the city, I like the environment, I like my teammates, I like the city really. What about this FIBA window coming up? Do you think you'll play in that for DR? Can you say that again? The FIBA window in November. Oh, I think I think I'm going. They sent the invitation, so I think I'm going. Bring that. You know, I like I, I love to play with a national team from the yard because they were the number one per, like organization who gave me the opportunity to show my talent to the world. You know, I, I'll, every time I'm, I'm available to play, I'm going to play the national team. I love playing for the Dominican Republic. I mean, first time we saw you, you were 13 years old playing for yeah. the Dominican Republic. You averaged nine points in, in 19 minutes. I mean, what was that like being a 13-year-old <laughs> playing up almost three years? <laughs> I didn't even know it, it, it wasn't going to happen in my life, you know, because I was, I was just a little kid playing with, you know, 16, 15-year-old guys. And 
at the first I wasn't ready to play that, but once I step out on the court, you know, I just I just did what I do. For a guy who is as young as you are, you've had a lot of experiences already. You know, play, playing in NBA Academy, uh, you know, playing in Spain, playing EYBL, high school in the U.S., the DME, and now here. You know, what, what do you take from each of those experiences? Like I said, man, I just try to, like, put the work on my game, try to improve. Every, everywhere I'm going, I try to do my best to get my, my game to the next level. And, you know, I, I appreciate all the culture who give me the opportunity to play with. And I feel so thankful for that. How important is it for you to get drafted really high in June? June? I mean, um, that, I think it, it, will, it will be a dream come true for my life because I, I, oh, when I was a kid, I always dreamed about being an NBA player. I mean, I'm working to get to the top five NBA top picks in the NBA in this draft, so I'm working on it. Any guys you model your game after in the NBA? NBA, I think Dennis Crudo, a lot. Um, who else? I used to watch a lot of Kobe's highlights, you know. Um, Paul George highlights, too. I think that those, those people, I think, I'm at a in the game. You planning on going to NBA games here? Any Hawks games? Go watch some Trey Young? No, yeah, but I will. I gotta go, I gotta go watch the NBA games. For sure. Yeah. Thanks man, thanks Thank so much. Thank you.